Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of this Untitled Pokemon Project. Still have no idea what we're going to call it, but we're on episode 3, and we're just going to continue right off where we were. See if I can remember my controls. It's still summer. I think we're going this way. What do they want? Philicus, it's this way. What's this way? Bianca says if we're starting a journey together, she wants us to all, or all to take our first step at the same time. Hey, Philicus, let's all take our first step on Route 1 together. Didn't he just say that? Okay, here we go. One, two, like the Wizard of Oz. Oh, I wonder what will happen. Isn't this so exciting? It is indeed. It sure is. Come on, the professor's waiting. Yay! Professor Juniper, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Now that everyone's here, I'll explain. The Pokedex's pages update automatically whenever you meet a Pokemon. Whoever set up that you obtain, whoever, or moreover, is set up that you obtain even more information. You obtain, okay, when you catch a Pokemon. Gotta get used to the way they're doing their chat thing. To make this clear, I'm going to demonstrate how to catch a Pokemon. Run through field grass, Pokemon appears. Rat attack. I think it's no, it's Putrat. It's Putrat. Wild Putrat used near. Encino's defense spell is football after tapping its HP. You hit the Pokeball thingamajig. Okay. I guess we have to hit a button to go. Did you see that just now? I did. Here's how it goes, step by step. First, reduce the Pokemon's HP. Pokemon that still have all of their energy are difficult to catch. If you can, use your Pokemon's moves to make the Pokemon you want to catch. Fall asleep or paralyze it. And to wrap this up in the best way, I have a gift for you. Some Pokeballs. Yay! No adventures are complete without Pokeballs. I put them in my case. Pokeballs are used for catching Pokemon and for carrying the Pokemon you catch. I'm going on ahead. I'll be waiting for you at Akuma Town. I imagine the Okay, sure enough. She forgot to say that Pokemon jump out at you in the tall grass. I'm heading to Akumula Town nap or two. Because I can read. I think I'll go too. I'm looking forward to the next town so I can go shopping for Pokeballs. Didn't she just give you Pokeballs? Wait a minute. Hey, listen, Bill gives Sharon. I thought of... Is it Sharon? Sharon? I don't know. I thought of something fun. But we need to get going. I'd imagine the professor's waiting, too. Will you just listen a sec? Seriously. Come on, guys. Why don't we see who can catch the most Pokemon? The person carrying the most Pokemon, including the one received from Professor Juniper, is the winner. Huh? Actually, that sounds interesting. I guarantee you it will be me. It will fill the Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it will please the professor too. Okay then, until we reach Accumula Town, take care of healing your Pokemon at your own house. Me and Snivy will do the best for sure. So what I like to do is I tend to hang out in here for a while. I'll see what I can do. 
little pup. That's a cutie. I'll toss the piggy at him. We will fight and tackle. I want to try to capture this one. Well, looks like it's probably tackle one more time and then try to catch. I usually like to get it in the orange or the red. Red is preferred, obviously. Alright, so bag, Pokeballs, Pokeball, use. Come on! Yay! Yay! I got me a female Lillipup. We're gonna call her a little bitch when she grows up. Because she's a female. I'm not trying to be crude. That's what you call female dogs. Long hair around its face provides an amazing radar that lets it sense subtle changes in its surroundings. Awesome. I'm not gonna name her yet. Let's see who this fool is. Oh, I guess we'll fight again. Another one! Oh, another female. I don't need another female. I'll just defeat this one. So we'll fight, tackle, lay the smack down. Critical hit. One shot kill, that's how I roll. Alright, let's check out this dude. All the Pokemon are hiding in the tall grass. What does this mean for you? It means when you want to battle or capture wild Pokemon, you should go walk in tall grass. What's the sign say? Trainer tips. Make an effort to talk to all people you meet during your journey. Chances are they'll have something useful to tell you. Well, that's what I did. Is your Pokemon's HP alright? When your Pokemon's HP decreases while you're on the road, it can be a big problem. So I'll give you this. Put it in your bag's medicine case. Potion! Put the potion in the medicine case. When your Pokemon's HP decreases, they no longer have energy to fight, so don't push your Pokemon too hard and let them rest often. Very useful tip. We'll go ahead and fight one more time. Not like I had a choice. I'm gonna try to capture this one too, because I don't have one yet. Hopefully I will one-shot kill this sucker. If I do, oh well, I can always try for another one. Awesome. Perfect. We'll go to the bag. can do it! Yay! Give a nickname to him. Nah. Not this time. I generally don't nickname him. I wonder what's over here. That looks like it could be fun later. Oh, frame rate issues. There we go. I imagine there will be a little bit of frame rate problem here and there. Root one. Alright, so I already obtained one of these. So I'm going to go ahead and try to defeat it. Nearly did it in one shot. That's okay. Sweet. Yay, little! Level 7. Ooh. 
nice. Looks like we're fighting again. Uh, a little pup. Nearly all these Pokemon I know nothing about. Oh, I should have used the Ember. What was I thinking? We'll use this next time. Ember, let's see how that works. Toasty! See what this lady has to say. Billy Chris, are you going to compare yourself with Bianca? I have two Pokemon with us. Well, guess what? I've got three. How about it, Vegas? Do you want to compare which one of us has the most Pokemon with us? Sure. Wow, three. That's awesome. Are you excited to have that many Pokemon with you? I sure am. Incidentally, if you check your Pokedex, you'll see how many Pokemon you've found and how many. You've caught. I'm off to Accumula Town. The professor is waiting. Picked up the transceiver. Hello, how's everybody doing? You're you and your Pokemon are getting along great, right? Oh Professor. Right now I'm in front of Accumula's Town Pokemon Center. I'd like to show you around, so hurry on over, everyone. Okay, Pokemon Center, right. Okay, see you. Blah, blah, blah. Well, I'm going on ahead. Good for you. You know what I want to do? I want to hang out back here for a sec. Fight at least once. One more for good measure. Fight, tackle. I could have used Ember, but that's okay. I'll use it this next time. Ember. Oh, almost. Get him this time with the tackle. Jerk. Almost. Alright. We'll continue on this time. Read the sign. A fast growing town. Talk to me. Some old Pokemon jump out of the tall grass and attack, but you can make friends with those Pokemon if you reach out to them. I sure can. Who's this? Well, that must be the professor. Ah, uh, Vilkis, there you are. Traveling with your Pokemon is truly one of the joys being a trainer. Please follow me. I'd like to show you the most important place for a trainer to know. <laughs> this is a Pokemon Center. Don't you feel better as soon as you step through the door? Okay, let's start your tour. Ooh, wait for me. A Pokemon Center is truly an incredible place. Do you know why? Because your Pokemon can be healed. And what's more, it's absolutely free. Pokemon Center is a trainer's best friend. Here, Vilkis, give it a try. Oh, I guess I gotta go. Hello, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. We restore your tired Pokemon to full health. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? Of course I would. Please hurt pretty bad. Very familiar sound. I think it's the same sound from the beginning. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay, now that your Pokemon have rested, I'll show you how to use PC at the Pokemon Center. I don't really want to know how to use PC. This is a PC. It's free for any trainer to use. You can store Pokemon 
in your PC boxes or select Pokemon stored in your PC boxes to take along with you. In addition, if you catch a new Pokemon, while you have six Pokemon traveling with you, the Pokemon will, you just caught is sent automatically to the PC network. Surprising, isn't it? Amazing, even here's something else that's cool. If you select my PC, I'll evaluate the progress you've made on your Pokedex. Professor, it says someone's PC on the screen. Who is someone? Very good, Bianca. That's a great observation. Good question. I'll, I'd like to say more, but for now, just ignore that and go ahead and use the PC. Someone is the person who made the Pokemon storage system. Someone I'm sure you'll meet someday. Okay, let's move on. I know who the summon is, I believe. He's in like every Pokemon game ever. But Professor Juniper, now this is the Pokemon Mart. Wait, did they include the Pokemon Mart in all the Pokemon centers now? This is a place to buy useful items and sell the ones that you don't need anymore. That gentleman over there will help you with a smile. So let's wrap this up. I've given you the basics of being a trainer. I'm going to head back to New Vima Town. One final thing. When you get to Straighten City, go and meet the inventor named Fennel. She's a friend of mine and long ago, from long ago, and I'm sure she'll help you on your way. Best of luck. I hope you, that you, I hope that your journey has proved to be adventure of a lifetime. Awesome. Ooh, what should I buy? Potions and Pokeballs are definitely important. Hmm, thinking. Well, before I buy anything, I want to go ahead and end the episode here. We'll pick off uh, next time with the Pokemart. Thank you for watching. We're still entitled. Go ahead and comment down below if you have a suggestion for that title. Um, hit the like, hit the subscribe, you know the drill. Thanks for watching, and you guys have a wonderful time. Goodbye.